Good evening, fellow zombie slayers. This is Zero with Versus and the Legend, and we are back with episode 9 of The Walking Dead Onslaught. And Carol is just, I don't know, spazzing out over there. She looked like she was dancing for a second. Anyway, <laughs> here we are with episode 9. We are back in Alexandria, our fully upgraded, fully functional outpost here, which we have worked very hard and killed many zombies. Right, Daryl? Right, Daryl? Oh, yes, you just... You're precious, aren't you? You're, you're just looking at with those those demonic puppy dog eyes of yours. All right. So what we're going to do today is we're going to do Chapter 7, The Promise. And it looks like we are well outfitted. We have a freaking katana. We have the crossbow. We have a shotgun and an assault rifle. And we are going to go through the white oak quarantine zone only to discover that things haven't gone according to plan. And when do they ever go according to plan, huh, Daryl? This is going to take forever. The last couple of ones that we did were like an hour. I'm getting on an hour. I'm guessing this one's probably going to be a very long run, and I'm going to have to make a lot of cuts. So without any further ado, let's do further. I'm going out to look after this. You can't stop me. Have you listened to a word I've said? Every last one. Made me realize you've already made up your mind. I know you think I'm wrong. Nah, you ain't wrong. But that don't mean you're right. I'm trying to understand why this girl is so important to you. If you don't get it by now, you ain't paying attention. Daryl, just finish the story. Fine, might as well. Told too much already not to. Aim for the head. Classic zombie law. Grab as much as you can, but don't get taken down. That's basically what I do, man. I am all about it. Winning mean just means we get tomorrow. I don't know. How, does anybody know how to pronounce Carol's last name? Chapter 7. The Promise. Why does this feel like this is... Back near her place. I thought I was as good as home. Why does this feel like it's going to be some sort of a climax? What the fuck? Pardon my language. Hello. Shit. I need to move. Oh, come on. They poured in. Explosion busted the gate system. Really? Okay, I actually am going to take it back when I uh, what I said about that upgrade. Because me saying this upgrade where the, walk, the, the shit goes through the walkers was not really worth it. Totally wrong. Because now I don't have to worry about the bolts disappearing because they're attached to a walker when it despawns. Oh my goodness. There's no dynamite there. But we can do that. What the fart? Oh shit. Hmm. Okay. You know what? Let's save some ammo.
All right, where's all my ammo? <laughs> uh, uh, there we go. Proof I am not a good shot with that or that, that crossbow. That's never a good thing. Pistol. Oh my god. There's lots of ammo. Um, I like the shotgun, but I think we're switching to this. Uh, garbage, garbage, garbage. What is this? Is this a burst pistol? Okay, well, we ain't got no ammo for that. Oh, I love the little skull on the side of that thing. I think I'm full on health. Yeah, I don't really need that. All right. Ooh. Found a pretty nice bow in there. You mean the one, like, kind of like the one I already got? <gasps> I don't need the cooker. Um. I kind of need to get a kill with this thing. There you go. Fiberglass roll. I'm glad I checked that out. Can't go that way, even though it, there, I see literally nothing blocking my. <gasps> no way! Yo! I don't need the shotgun. Stick bundle, wire. Oh, I don't want the hammer. Fuck that. I'm gonna take the kukri. All right, you know what? We're not passing up the axe. We're just not doing it. We're not passing up the axe. I mean, look at this fucking thing. Hey, well, it's my birthday. I really like the katana, though, and it's got all the upgrades. Alright. Hey, guys. I'm getting lots of stuff here. Look at that. This is the axe of that big guy who follows King around. And I love it. Oh, 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 oh. It's a bundle of sticks. Come on. Wow, that is some solid ass soccer ball. You get back up. Do it without a foot. All that food, and I have no use for it anymore because I've gotten all the food that there is to get. Okay, well that zombie either doesn't see me or doesn't care. Hey buddy! 
Buried that shit in his ear. Okay, can we stop making noises? As far as I can tell, Daryl's masturbating and he won't stop. He just needs something to get him over that hill. Something's really bugged out about this thing. Can't go that way. And get up. Eh. Uh. Uh. Another fiberglass. Well, that's nice. All right. If he doesn't stop the masturbating, I'm going to reload a checkpoint or something. I had was to trust her. Head to nearby yard. You. Okay, that was weird. Yo! How many did I shoot? I shot a lot there. I am not a good shot with that thing. I really should just stop using it entirely. I need spray and pray. That's it. Uh, okay. Okay. I was about to say, I think I saw something else here somewhere. You find that radio? I'm almost there. Yep. To get the car out, we need to repair the generator. Before the fuse is blue. What can I do? Go at that. Check each house for toolboxes with spare fuses inside. Got it. Okay. That seems simple enough. Not sure what I took off on him. It appeared to be his head. And an arm. What is this? Hydrochloric acid. <sighs> you dumb fucker. Fuse. Did you look through Daisy's journal? Yeah. W what did the journal say? Not important. Right now. Oh, wow, they're just flooding in, huh?
Yeah. Nitrogen. Great stuff. I don't know where they went. Oh, there he is. Okay, I actually kind of like the battle axe. It seems to have like a natural armor piercing thing. Oops. That was weird. I'm not entirely sure where I'm going. Cool there. <laughs> you know what? Y'all seem busy over there. So I'm not going to disturb you in the slightest. Looks like they were really trying to... Looks like they were really trying to build something here. Down, girl. Another fuse box. One more fuse. Please, I need to know if she's out there. Last entry says she was getting moved to another base. Can't say for sure, but I think she made it.
Okay. No need now. What does this all say? Hold on. Let's take some time to, to get educated. Okay, here. Survival rules. Team up. Make sure you have a buddy sh system. Number one. Make sure always to be fit and limber. Know your surroundings. Always be alert. An attack could come at any time. Ideal wear means tight clothes and short hair. Don't want things to get caught and hold you up. I'm keeping an eye out. Wear sensible footwear. Here's footwear. Heels and flip-flops are hard to move in and loud. Be sensible with supplies. Only keep what you need. Watch what you eat. Not all food is still edible. I am trying to become an educated man here. You are disturbing my light reading. Get out of the class. None of you have a hall pass. Huh? Fuck off. Okay. Let's see. Rule number eight. <laughs> when collecting, choose canned over produce. Avoid collecting in areas overrun with walkers. Travel light as no place is safe. Only safer? Jeez, these guys are so rude. Always have a backup plan and think ahead. You never know when your only way could be blocked by walkers. Really? Avoid attention detection. Only use distractions when needed as they could fail you in a worse situation. I mean, they're good, they're good, they're good, um, good rules here. Don't name the walkers, they are not your friend or pet. Dispose of all bodies, no exceptions, this isn't someone you know anymore, burn it. 14, keep calm, panicking isn't helpful to anyone. The walkers have no fear, why should you? Always aim for the head. Always carry a melee weapon, blades never need reloading. When all else fails, everything is a weapon, get creative. Two at once. Keep hope alive. Be there for each other. Everyone has lost someone to walkers. Go away. I'm reading. Make sure to enjoy the happy moments. Stay sane. Find a hobby you enjoy that doesn't involve walkers you may have cleared the area of walkers but the threat lives on in all of us i told you motherfuckers i am busy reading i know you in illiterate rednecks probably couldn't read before you got turned into walkers yes i get it it's time to leave multiplication oh Neat. They were teaching them math and stuff. I mean, this was a really nice place before you assholes moved in. I don't like the neighbors, alright? I will not be suggesting this or recommending this to the Homeowners Association. God damn. Thirsty bitches. Come on down. That one's open already.
Jesus, they are all over the goddamn place. I think it's all about just continuing to move. Fiberglass roll. Worst case scenario, I can ask a couple of questions and get through the crowd. Just confuse them. That's my plan. How do I get back? I think I came out of this one. Oh, that's not good. There we go. Give me these a couple of seconds before they fucking pop in and... At some point, they will. Okay. I'm out front. Go around the side of the garage. It'll get you to the house with the generator. I ain't taking the chance that any of these bitches are getting up. Jesus, it's like a shrine to fast food right there. Okay, video game rules. Giant red cable is power cord. You should be close. You Just think it's here. a giant fucking building with a huge... Or the, the, the building with the giant power sign on it. See, I hear that sound. Every time I hear that sound, I think a walker has seen me. Why? Because they use the exact same sound effect in Saints and Sinners. And it always meant that you were being spotted by a walker. Who wants to get filled full of lead? Honey, I'm home. Anybody? Dude, for a second I thought I saw a person on the TV. I was like, no way. They got cable here? I'm just staying here. Fuck y'all. Fuck y'all. All right. Lots of ammo here, man. Jesus. Found it. You say that. And I'll hook it back into the grid from here. Oh boy. I'm trying to get control of the gates. Just get back on front. Anybody else need to get shot in the face?
Oh shit. Somebody's messaging me and I can't answer it. Whew. Well, let's go search the room that they busted out of. Oh shit, I'm really glad I did. I can't see a fucking thing. <laughs> Cannot see a fucking thing. Alright. Whoo boy. All right, well, not sure what the deal is with that. I can't open any of these things. Somehow, I still have friggin' ammo, which is amazing to me. I haven't even upgraded this thing, and it... I must say, it's a little underwhelming. I mean, it's a friggin' assault rifle. Like, you would think... Okay, we're gonna skip that. Out, and y'all can hang out back there by yourselves. The hell's going on? <laughs> the outer gate isn't responding. Keep the walkers away from the house. The truck out front should have gear in. Nah, bitch! I ain't leaving you! Oh, Jesus! Them some spiky boys! Well, this is the best upgraded weapon I've got. I don't think so, motherfuckers! I need to go get me some ammo. Well, why couldn't I not move there for a minute? Not wasting any bullets on your lone ass! There's more you need oh, there's always more coming, isn't there? Stop telling me to leave, bitch! Shit. Oh, dear Lord. Ah, it's not looking good. No, 
Oh, man. Oh, dear Lord. Oh, dear Lord. The car is ready. Take it. Or neither of us is getting out. Bitch. There has to be another way. Get back to the garage. Take the car. Promise me you'll find Daisy. She needs. I'm opening the garage. It's time for you to go. Daryl. I. I promise. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Back to the garage. Now. But then I don't get to shoot all the zombies. I think they just keep coming. Okay, yeah, may, maybe maybe a little too many walkers. Just a couple too many walkers. If I can kill all the walkers, maybe I can drag Daisy's mom with me, no? Oh shit, yeah, no. How the fuck am I out of ammo for the shotgun? Alright, where's the car? Oh, oh man! I was really worried that I was like in the wrong spot. I have no ammo. Oh fuck. I was getting a little, I was getting a little touchy, a little bit like, whew, touch and go at the end. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, I could have pulled out the crossbow, that would not have stopped them. I needed many bullets. <sighs> I know we have things that need doing back here, Rick, but I need to do this. Where's my stumpy so, legs? Ooh. Coming or not? Carol, Michonne, Rick. We can't just wait and see. What's the decision, Rick? Rick? You can't leave a little girl out there. Carol will be pissed. Michonne will look down on you. Dara's not going to be happy about it, neither. What? What the fuck? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? Is that where... Come on! No, 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 really? Dude, dude. Oh, I can't believe they just did that to me. That was like the worst fucking cliffhanger. Like all of that just to fucking save this little girl and fucking Daryl spends all that time trying to convince Rick that this is the right fucking thing to do. And like right at the end. Rick's just like, well, you see, fade to black. Motherfuckers. You motherfuckers. <laughs> Seriously, it's bullshit. <sighs> that actually wasn't as long as the last one, man. Chapter 6 lasted way long. Was that the end of the game? That was the end of the game, wasn't it? Ooh, I got 9. I can do some more upgrades. <laughs> yeah. SMG. Hammer. Battle axe. We already had the SMG. What was that? I don't understand. Oh, I found an SMG while I was there. I already had an... Uh, whatever. It's fine. 
So, that was, I guess, the end of the Walking Dead onslaught, for now at least. It, it really feels like they purposefully left it open for, like, you know, a, a sequel of some kind. Like, it, it feels like that's not the end of it. Like, that's the end of the game, clearly, so far. As near as I can tell, at least. Thanks for having my back. Glad to see you came around on some things, too. It's going to be tough bringing the community together. We'll get there. This is a new start for all of us. Hmm. Fascinating. Really fascinating, honestly. That's the, I guess, default loadout. Two melee weapons. I've never seen the purpose of bringing multiple melee weapons. You want one, one good melee weapon, in my, in my humble opinion. All right, so we have one thing left. Should help out there. I know. I brought it back. Hose head found in a bucket. So we have one thing left. I want Alex, we want Alexander to go as much as we propose. We'll need to automate the watering system. As are always. Okay. I got to do one more thing. So that is going to be the next episode. It's probably going to be a long ass supply run. It's going to be the last thing that we do. So we've got everything upgraded. We may do some achievement hunting on this, but it's probably going to be. Um, it's probably going to be a. Uh, a stream thing that we do on stream so for now no nah, i'm good anyway well that was the end of the storyline we still have the one scavenging run to do all right folks that's it for episode nine that is the end of the story we're done with the ca the campaign stuff all right, no more sitting around the campfire with Daryl unless we feel like it and going back for achievements and stuff because there are achievements to go back and do all of this on a uh, veteran, which I probably will do, but I'm going to do that like on stream or something. I'm not doing that on video. That's unless unless somebody requests it, I will, I'm not going back. So unless you guys in the comments request me to go back and do it in uh, on veteran mode, I will on veteran mode. If you request it but for now that's the end of the story mode we have one more episode to do where we do the last scavenging run we got one scavenging run we have not done on video okay um but for now that's the, that's the end of the the story we are going to come back we're going to do one more episode to do the last scavenging run that'll be episode 10 for now though that this is zero signing off wishing all of my fellow zombie slayers happy hunting safe travels and Stab some fucking walkers in the head for me. Until next time, this has been Zero with First Ascent into Legend, signing off.